On Monday night, after a lengthy discussion, the school board voted to extend three school days to make up three of the five missed days due to bad winter weather. The plan was contingent upon approval by the new Boston School Board, which it did later in the week. Making up the three days still means that two days will be added to the end of the school year. The last day of school is now set for June 20th. Beginning May 2nd and continuing until that last day, 30 minutes total will be added to the school days, 15 minutes at the beginning and 15 minutes at the end. Any additional school closures may extend the school year further. Gosstown High School seniors will graduate on June 15th. Mountain View Middle School 8th grade promotion day will take place on June 14th. A letter detailing the changes was sent home to parents. At the Zoning Board of Adjustment meeting on Tuesday, members approved a property owner's plan to rebuild a single-family home on an existing foundation on Blackbrook Road. A house on the foundation was destroyed in a fire in 2015 while occupied by the previous owner. The current owner, who purchased the property a few months ago, needed to come to the ZBA because the foundation doesn't meet the town's 35 feet front property line setback requirements and the town's 25 feet side property line setback requirement. In addition to granting an equitable waiver, the ZBA also approved a special exception for an accessory dwelling unit on the new house. At Wednesday night's Economic Development Council meeting, members praised the town's new website. They like the crisp, clean look and a section that lists commercial properties in town for lease or sale. You can access the New England Commercial Property Exchange in the new website's business section. And of course, you can see the website at gostown.com. And that's three things that you need to know from this week's meetings. If you want to check out the complete meetings, please visit our on-demand page or you can catch the replays on Channel 22.